Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. And of course, guys, today I'll be going through how to fix the Galaxy S10 charging pause error. And of course, you saw the error earlier where it shows on screen pause in charge. This can happen in two cases, whether you're using a wireless charger or a wired charger. And of course, you can always check out these tips. Do try them out in the order that's given. We start from the very simple and then work our way up. All right, so let's go straight in. So let's get straight into it, all right? Now, um, the first thing you want to do, guys, is if in case you're having that error, is just go ahead and restart the phone. So just hold on the power button, then hit restart. You can also, you can um, restart or, of course, you can power off. Either will work. And once you do that, just boot back up and you should be good to go. Next thing you want to do, guys, is to check for a faulty adapter. Now, of course, the adapter here might be faulty. One of the main things that might go wrong is that this cable here, which is the USB cable, might not be any good. Or, of course, the adapter brick itself might be broken. And if it's broken, it can start giving er errors or problems in that it might be um, a short in the cable. And that short might be going and coming. Thus, you get the, um, the error. Or of course, this might be going. And, of course, it's working at one point and then not working at another. Thus, you're getting the error. And while we're on that, guys, the third option is that you're going to make sure that you use a original um, charger, which we call the OEM, which is Original Equipment Manager, meaning the one that came with your phone. Now, of course, even if it's not the one that came with your phone, make sure it's a Samsung branded um, charger that works with your device. You can always purchase them online to search for OEM chargers. For example, this one is the Original Fast Charger that um, comes with most um, samsung devices so just go ahead and make sure that you have the original um, adapter that samsung um, supported next uh, you're going to update your phone so right away guys we're going to go go ahead and un wake up this device here and once you wake up the device you're going to go into um, settings scroll down and right here is going to hit while you're connected to the internet you're going to um, just go ahead and go to software update and of course, you're going to download um, and install. It's going to check for um, the connection. I'm going to check here for updates. And there you go. If there's an update, it should tell you or prompt you here. And you can always update your device. Updates tend to have bug fixes. And those bug fixes might be related to charging as well as other issues. Um, next, you're going to um, reset app preferences. So you're going to go to settings, apps. So we're going to go into settings. Then we're going to go to apps. And we're going to click right here. And uh, we're going to go reset our preferences. I'm going to do it right now to show you the stop and hit reset. And once you reset our preferences, it might fix the um, problem. Now, another thing is that there might be a faulty app on your device. Meaning, one that you installed recently. So, as a rule of thumb, I always recommend that you go back to the last three apps that you install. And then uninstall all three. And of course, if the problem is fixed, you'll know that it's one of those apps. You can always reinstall them and try them one at a time until you isolate the single app that's causing the problem or of course if it's not that particular app um, you can um, find a substitute app so let's say um, out of the three apps that you uninstall you found that it's one you can always um, look for an alternative app that's more stable that won't trigger the issue so you won't lose those apps as most likely you'll want to use them all right so that is um, the other one next you're gonna uh, reset up settings our reset settings so you're going to go ahead to settings general management reset i'm going to reset settings so that's settings scroll down to the bottom here general management reset and while we're under reset here we're going to um reset um we're going to reset settings so we're going to choose the option that says reset settings i'm going to restore all of the settings to their defaults which is good in some cases to fix in the problem and if all else fails guys we're going to reset your phone so let's go ahead and back up your phone and once you back up your phone, you're going to do the factory and data reset. Be warned, this will erase all the data on your phone. And once you do that, in some cases, if it's a software issue, that one should fix it. And if all else fails, guys, it might be that your port here is going. And there is a problem with the port itself. It's damaged and it needs replacing. And in such a case, what I advise that you do is that you take it in for repair or take it back to the store if your device is on a warranty. And of course, they'll deal with that. Alright guys, so that has been about 9 tips you can use to fix the issue where your Galaxy um, S10 charging pause, you are getting the Galaxy S10 charging pause error and how to deal with it. Alright guys, this is Ricardo Gardner from Blog Tech Tips, looking at some cool tips that you can use 
to fix the charging pause or charging pause error. So we're going to go on the same. Bye until next time. Bye.